Government is in the process of assessing the curriculum for science and technology to be relevant to changing technology. At the inauguration of three electronic learning platforms, the Minister for ICT, Frank Tumwebaze, said government will harmonize with Curriculum Development Center to fit the curriculum meet the moving times. He was at the International Business Science and Technology University, ISPAT. Education sector has adapted to electronic platforms to improve the quality of education and make it convenient for learners across board. International Business Science and Technology University, ISBAT, has innovated two learning platforms, blended and skilling, to help students access resources and learning materials online. This virtual learning platform is a unique education philosophy that deals with holistic education, emphasizing artificial intelligence. Of uh, university degrees, which require certain skills. There are some uh, uh, academic uh, uh, courses which does not give you any skill at all. So as you are here using this platform, you can get the skill that you want. Some of them will be just through the, the platform, but others will be face-to-face. -face. But in the absence of the face-to-face, -face, at least you are able to get the skill that you need. Inaugurating the innovations, the Minister of ICT, Frank Tumwebaze, said education should prepare a child to be innovative. You, you saw my ministry, supported by the president, we launched the fourth industrial task force where different university professors are part of. We want to see whether our curriculum in the field of science and technology is still relevant or whether we need to review it. This innovation will also benefit the youth. This is a modern technology where the classrooms, instead of you coming to us, the education is going to the students as per their convenient time. It is a 24 into 7 program. So as per their timings, they can go through the notes. They can interact with the faculties. There is modules available in various lectures in various domains. Management, IT, in all the faculty systems are available there. Students of ISBAT have also developed an electronic sports platform for video game competitions with universities to improve their skills. I'm Navka Farida, reporting in Kampala. There is the leading